So here's an example of a Max MSP um, jitter, now known as Max 5, uh, file I did a little while ago. And um, it's basically a video editor where uh, video A can be superimposed with video B. Um, let's just show an example. A cool thing in Max 5 is to be able to drop, so I'm dropping a whole folder of movies in these fields here, and then these drop downs are populated with movies and um, so I can populate it with different movies um, and then I can set the loop points within any given movie uh, and uh, fade in between them uh, and then it's really helpful also to uh, be able to record it I can record what's being produced and then feed that back into the um, the movies that, that are within this drop down menu to then be reused and so you can imagine layers upon layers but the real power of this particular program and really one of the fundamental powers of Max 5 is is the ability to manipulate uh, every single pixel um, and so for example I have these bitwise op bitwise operators um, bitwise uh, no this is bitwise XOR um, and then bitwise or not a huge amount of difference um, here's just straight add well, part of the we get a different movie here uh, let's try these and then uh, these are pretty dramatic um, so it it's really a fun tool and it's also powerful uh, in terms of how deep it can dig into these original files um, and Max 5 if if you're f familiar with it I mean this is presentation mode it's somewhat organized <laughs> and uh, it, it's different interface you know I can change uh, as I said before the loop points and um, start stop uh, and clear uh, reload D different movies uh, to do different things um, but this is really the fun is back here let me zoom out so now we can now we can see all the spaghetti um, this really is pretty fun and y what's great is I mean you can still watch it functioning I have to scroll down here to see this window um, but you know here are our operators uh, and and these are all the all the functions that you can plug in in editing mode and then um, patch them together to to do different functions so yeah I had a lot of fun doing this and um, there are a couple more examples I'll, I'll see if I can't track them down